Hey everyone, Brian here from Honest Mechanic. Today's topic is turbochargers, those nifty devices that boost your engine's power. So what exactly is a turbocharger, you may ask? Well, it's a bit of engineering magic that uses the power of your engine's exhaust gases. These gases are funneled to spin a turbine, and this spinning turbine then powers a compressor. Now here's where the fun begins. This compressor forces more air into your engine, more air means more oxygen, and more oxygen means that more fuel can be burned. Each tiny explosion in your engine becomes that much more powerful, giving your vehicle an extra pep in its step, so to speak. In essence, a turbocharger is like a personal trainer for your car's engine, pushing it to perform at its peak. But remember, just like any mechanical device, turbochargers can wear out over time due to a variety of factors. Turbochargers can fail for several reasons, often related to maintenance and operation. Let's break them down. First, inadequate lubrication. Regular engine oil changes are vital. If neglected, the oil can thicken and gum up, clogging the turbo's return line and preventing proper oil circulation. This can lead to leaks and serious damage over time. Second, overspeeding. Pushing the engine to rev beyond the redline RPM can cause the turbo to spin faster than it's designed to, which can overboost the engine and lead to oil starvation inside the turbo. Third, oil starvation. If oil supply pipes are blocked or leaking, or if the turbo isn't properly primed on fitting, oil may not reach the turbo, causing extensive damage. Fourth, oil contamination. Dirty or contaminated oil can harm internal components, leading to premature wear and tear. Lastly, foreign object damage. Turbos spin at over 100,000 RPM. Any debris, like dust or metal, can severely damage the turbo wheels and blades. These are the main culprits behind turbocharger failure, so it's crucial to be aware of them and avoid these pitfalls. Now that we know the causes, let's move on to the symptoms of a failing turbocharger. One of the first signs that your turbocharger is in trouble is low engine power. If your car doesn't accelerate as quickly or struggles to reach high RPM, your turbo may not be providing the boost it should. Blue exhaust smoke is another indicator. This is caused by engine oil leaking past worn turbo seals and into the exhaust system. You might also hear an unusual turbo whistle. This high-pitched squealing noise signals turbo bearing wear. If you notice a burning oil odor, it could be that oil is leaking into the exhaust. Your car's check engine light can also alert you to turbocharger issues. The engine's computer detects problems through sensors and triggers the light. A drop in fuel economy is another symptom. A faulty turbo has to work harder, which can hurt your gas mileage. And lastly, look out for oil leaks around the turbo from worn seals. These symptoms are telltale signs of a turbocharger on its last legs. In summary, common turbo failure causes are inadequate lubrication, over-revving, oil starvation, contamination, and foreign objects. We've walked through the ins and outs of turbochargers, how they work, and the signs that might indicate yours is on the fritz. We've underscored that low engine power, blue exhaust smoke, a distinct turbo whistle, a burning oil odor, a lit check engine light, poor fuel economy, and oil leaks are all symptoms of a potentially failing turbocharger. But remember, prevention is better than cure. Regular maintenance and proper operation are the keys to a turbocharger's longevity. Don't push your engine beyond its limits. Change your oil regularly. Keep the turbocharger clean and free from foreign objects. Keep an eye out for these signs your turbo may be wearing out. If you notice any, don't hesitate to seek professional help. And remember, a well-maintained turbocharger means a well-performing vehicle. Stay safe and happy driving.